in this middle heavy division. She took second. So she's here to redeem that with the gold medal. This is the debut, I believe, of her opponent, Tolito. We don't know much about her. She sits into a quick De La Hiva overhook guard. Wow. She's, uh, she's going to try to spin underneath here now. Yep. She's going to try to get the belt grip, spin right underneath. According to the chat room, Talita won the Abu Dhabi trials down in Brazil. It's going for a toehold, Penny Thomas, but that's going to let Talita get to the top. And she won't get any points until she gets out of that. out and she's going to get two points for that. And the C now. Talita pushing the foot, feet over. She needs to seal one of the arms to the mat. Oh, she's doing a nice job of sliding by there actually. Penny Thomas on a single. He lifts up. Talita has the inside hip which helps counter. Penny rolls to the guard. Talita is on her back, though. Yeah, this could be bad if she gets that left yeah, leg around. Jump that over. Comes. Right leg, sorry. Yeah. The hooks aren't in, so it's still just two to zero. Yes. Talita is up right now, two to zero. She's threatened in the back, but uh, this is a tricky position. Penny can pull her back into the half guard position, which looks like that's what's going to happen here. She's going to start bringing her head up, and she's going to be in half guard. So, and now she's got a very nice underhook on the left hand side. Cross face, so she's going to the mount first. But she's going to need to watch that underhook arm. She's going to try to step over the head, maybe. Deep half guard. Toledo with feeding the lapel to the left hand. We'll see if she changes it to an underhook grip with the right hand now underneath the leg. here. She's working the collar. Penny has an underhook here. Far side. So she's going to maybe step around and go for an arm here. What's the best way to extricate that left leg of Penny's right there? That's how she's doing right now, circling around the head. She might have liked to grab the knee. She looked like she was going to grab the knee. She potentially could grab the knee and slide this right leg around for to threaten an arm lock. And sometimes that frees your foot. Here she, she's coming right there. She needs to hold that knee though. though. She's going to try to get that foot out. And this sometimes frees that foot. She can go for a triangle here. But uh, Talita recovered nice. She might have made a little bit of a mistake on her, on her weight shift, which allowed Talita to get to the top. You don't want to sacrifice that top position there just to get your foot out. Penny likes that fighter guard. Yeah, Talita is bullfighting right through it right yeah. now. She's already bullfought past once uh, to get to that back position.
Sean Pateta Williams. <laughs> it might stick. Nice bowl fighting from Talita to again get near the back, but Penny does a really nice job of rolling through. Yeah, Penny has a gymnast background. I think uh, until the age of like 11 or 12, she was a serious gymnast. She had a big back injury at that young age and then ah. got that corrected but couldn't continue in gymnastics. Still with some leg work. We're halfway through the match. So Talita's up 4-0 right now. Again, she bull fights through to around the back, but again, Penny rolls through. Now she is upside down. But you think she's hunting that knee? Or? She, she looks to be, but her right foot's not in good position right now. She's going to spin around for maybe a triangle. There it goes. That was a really nice try. But Talita saw that coming, so... Spider guard to a single. Uh-oh, deep half. Yep, she's in deep half, and she's going to be the Bernardo Fadia. Yeah. <laughs> she needs to start feeding that ghee. The lead is in good position here, fairly good position. Now she's getting kind of off her angle, so she's going to have to step back around, so she does. Try to get to the back. Penny rolls through again. Very nice. Now she's bull fighting through Talita. So we've got three and a half minutes left. Talita continues up four to zero. Yeah. So Penny needs to do something. Now maybe she looks to elevate, but Talita sticks the right knee in into the thigh, which will kill that. Penny still with the, with the spider guard here. So she's got, she's got the foot on the bicep. Maybe she tried to sweep to her right. Talita has done a very nice job of goal fighting through that. Yeah, very impressive so far from Talita. I mean, yeah. this is our first exposure to her here yeah. at the Worlds, if I'm not mistaken. So. Yeah. There's the sweep. She's given it a, a go here with that foot on the bicep. She may try it again. Nice triangle attempt. Now she's got something a little locked. She may at least get Omoplata out of this, but nope. Talita just slides her head right out, fixes her elbow position. And he rolls through. 7.45 in, as you guys see in the background, so we're a little over two minutes left to go. Again, she takes the back, the back of turtle position. Penny will again roll through, looks like. One and a half left now to go. And what do you think, Caleb? I think Penny's going to have to step it up here a little bit. Yeah, I think, uh, and, and, and not only step it up, but try something different. Yeah. Because whatever she's been doing so far hasn't worked. And in a way, I got to say, I mean, I don't really recall. I mean, we've got a limited number of girls at this level still in jiu-jitsu. Yeah. And these two are kind of like mirror images, in body size and shape. Yeah. You know, so I don't, I mean, Penny's faced many different foes and sizes. But uh, at the same time, it's just interesting to see what happens when we have kind of a mirror of her against her. Yeah. Lita is doing a really nice job. Now Penny's on a single, so she's probably going to score with this. There it is. She gets her points. She's got two points. 40 two. seconds left to yeah. go. Four to two with 30 seconds yeah. left. 
Oh, but now they take off. Now they take it away and only give her an advantage. So now with 25 seconds left, she's going to need to do something pretty big here. It's down by four. Plus, she's down by three, two advantages. She's going to need more than taking the back. Even though if she gets in the back, it'll even the score. She's still going to lose. Time runs out. Talita's going to take it. Talita Noguera is going to be the middle heavyweight 2011 women's world champion. A new face. Yes. <laughs> That's great. <laughs> yeah, very nice job to both ladies. Ladies and gentlemen, the 2011 medium heavy champion of the world from Gracie Elite, Dalita Nogueira. And once again, we'll see if we can.